all know Tyra Banks is a supermodel and is the famous host of America's Next Top Model, but did you know that she was also somewhat of an interior designer and celebrity house flipper? Tyra long resided in a Beverly Hills mansion as well as a multi-million dollar New York City duplex, but she's also bought and sold multiple properties in the Pacific Palisades area, making her current living situation a little bit of a puzzle. But not to worry, in this video we'll give you all the details on Tyra's mansions, we even found the listing. Tyra Banks is a supermodel, TV personality, actress, producer, businesswoman, author, and more who began her modeling career at the young age of 15. Whether she was gracing the covers of GQ or walking the Victoria's Secret runway as an angel, by the early 2000s, Tyra was officially one of the world's top earning models. Over the years, she's built a pretty impressive resume between creating and presenting the long-running reality show America's Next Top Model, hosting her own talk show which I used to be obsessed with, and much, much more. But could Tyra also be America's Next Top House Flipper? The supermodel has proven that not only can she rule the runway, she can rule the real estate market too. Over the past few years, she's bought numerous homes in California, renovated them, and sold them for a profit, showing no signs of stopping either. Most recently, her sites have been focused on the ritzy area of Pacific Palisades, where where Tyra is thought to currently live, in a home that she didn't resell, obviously. It was reported she purchased an outdated four bedroom home for just over three million here, that she plans to transform into a farmhouse meets beach cottage and sell, but we'll look at that in just a bit. With an estimated net worth of almost a hundred million dollars, Tyra can clearly afford these house projects. Not to mention the model turned real estate mogul is pocketing a pretty penny with each of these property investments. Hey guys, it's Karen. Today we're doing another house tour here on Famous Entertainment. We'll be taking a look at where Tyra Banks calls home from her modern mansion in Pacific Palisades to her longtime Beverly Hills spot, some of her fixer uppers, and more. If you like these videos, make sure you're subscribed and ring that bell to be notified when we post. You can always be up to date. We've also done house tours and likes of Chrissy Teigen and Demi Lovato, and we'll link to some at the end. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and as usual, let me know whose house tour is next in those comments down below. Now let's get into this video. First off, Tyra Long owned a Beverly Hills home from 2004 until around 2016. Back in the early 2000s, a supermodel paid just under $4 million for the place according to records. She had fallen for the property the moment she laid her eyes on it and she claims that, This stunning Spanish architecture spoke to me the minute I walked in the door. I loved living in this house. The Spanish style colonial home was built back in the 1920s and was once owned by actress Marion Davies. It sat on a quarter acre of land in the exclusive Beverly Hills post office area, much loved by celebrities, and the estate could be entered from a gated courtyard with fountain. Tyra's longtime home spanned 5,740 square feet of living space with four beds, five full baths, and two half baths. was full of preserved elements of the original architecture such as vintage French doors, terracotta roof and exposed wood beams. There was also a unique rotunda shaped entryway which was visible from the exterior. Among the common areas, there was a living room, formal dining room, sunroom, library and great room topped with rustic beams and views of the outdoor area. Not to mention there's an impressive chef's kitchen which was one of the rooms Tyra remodeled while living here. In fact, she spent a whopping 2 million bucks on fixing up the place, also adding an outdoor kitchen and outdoor her living room with a fireplace and TV, where she said she liked to spend her summer evenings. Tyra transformed the large garage into a home gym too. Tyra's previous master suite here offered a sitting room, a model worthy walk-in closet as well as a safe room inside. Outside, the fully fenced and hedged Beverly Hills house had a yard with swimming pool and pavilion with fire pits. Of course, there's also that outdoor kitchen and dining room Tyra added on, which provided seating for 12 guests. Although she listed the place for about 7.75 million, it ended up selling in 2016 for 6.3 mil, still giving the supermodel a couple million more than she paid. So like I said, Tyra has become a house flipping queen it seems, and her sights have been focused on the posh area of Pacific Palisades in Los Angeles. Pacific Palisades is an affluent neighborhood 
neighborhood between the Santa Monica Mountains and the Pacific Ocean, where many rich and famous choose to call home. Tyra also grabbed herself a home here, it seems, because it was reported online she bought this place in spring 2018, and we found the listing where it shows it was last sold in March 2018 as well. This makes me almost certain it's the spot Tyra is currently calling home with her family these days. Anyway, she spent just shy of $7 million on the multi-story contemporary style mansion. It offers perfect ocean views sitting just above the downtown shopping and dining district of Pacific Palisades. Tyra's current modern mansion was built in 2014 and spans 6,160 square feet of living space with 5 beds and 6 baths. The exterior is made of clean cut white stucco and offers expansive windows and slim balconies all over. Walking in her home, the front door opens up to a combination living and dining room with wide plank hardwood floors. and windows with views over the treetops and Pacific Ocean. Less formal family spaces include an open style kitchen with sleek cabinets, marble counters, and an oversized island with snack bar. There's a double sided fireplace separating the casual dining area from a cozy family room with a brick wall, built in media cabinet and wall of floor to ceiling glass sliders opening up to a small deck above the yard. The ground floor offers a roomy bedroom suite for guests or staff, a walk in wine cellar, a home gym, a children's playroom and a double height games room or media lounge complete with a wet bar, in-ceiling speaker system, and a 120-inch projection screen. Bedrooms in Tyra's home are well separated for privacy, and there's an additional main floor bedroom that could double as an office. On the upper level, you'll find two more bedrooms as well as a spacious top floor master suite, which offers a sitting room, fitted walk-in closet, and spa-style bath with walkout terrace. Moving outside of Tyra's modern mansion, the terrace backyard offers a plunge-sized infinity pool. There's also a fancy rooftop terrace with a built-in barbecue, fire pit with built-in seats, Seating, a partially sunken hot tub, and of course, perfect views of the ocean, mountain, and city from every angle. So aside from that contemporary Pacific Palisades mansion Tyra is likely living in currently, the supermodel has bought a handful of million dollar homes in the same area over the last year or two. These homes she bought, renovated, and resold for a profit, and there's been probably about five so far, so Tyra has been busy. Most recently last year, Tyra bought this home in Pacific Palisades over asking price for about $3 million, but it only spans 1,600 square feet of living space or so. This house has 4 beds and 2 baths and has been in the same family for 70 years, of course in desperate need of a makeover. The traditional bungalow is in a desirable area right beside a high bluff and views of the coastline, but the home itself is pretty undesirable. The house is arranged around an entry courtyard and although it's clean and well kept, it's definitely dated. The living and dining rooms have elegant but old fashioned parquet flooring and the tiny kitchen even has floral wallpaper. The carpeted den is anchored by a huge stone fireplace and has dark brown and wood paneling all over like it's from the 70s. Other features include a skylight top sunroom, courtyard and a small separate backyard. Although this house looks super old school, Tyra claimed her plan is to transform it into a farmhouse meets beach cottage. We've yet to discover if her project is finished yet, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. Like I said, this is far from the first home Tyra has bought in the Pacific Palisades with the intention of flipping. There was this much bigger contemporary mansion she bought for around 7 million in 2016 and sold it for 8.9 mil as well as a few others. Let's not forget Tyra has also long maintained a real estate foothold in New York City too. She lived in a giant condo here for some time on a high floor of a luxury tower in Lower Manhattan's Battery Park City. She bought the place in 2009 for just above $10.1 million. Her property here is actually a combination of four units that span the 23rd and 24th floors according to the New York Times, resulting in 7,000 square feet of living space with five beds, five baths and three half baths. Other features of her New York condo included multiple kitchens and kitchenettes, a dressing room, hair salon, and a personal gym. Not to mention, Tyra added a dining alcove with banquette seating that was designed to feel like a booth at a Michelin starred restaurant. Now we 
know Tyra moved to the West Coast to raise her family and currently resides in the Pacific Palisades, but I'm not sure if she's officially unloaded her New York real estate yet. The mansion sized condo came up for sale at one point in 2017 for 17.5 million and on several other occasions. More recently, the apartment was available to rent at the massive cost of 50K per month, so I'm wondering if Tyra has found a tenant yet. So that's all I got for Tyra Banks and where she calls home, and from what we've seen, we can add real estate mogul to the supermodel's already full resume. It's clear that Tyra has become a celebrity house flipper and loves nothing more than investing in a home and turning it for a profit. Not to mention she lived in some super gorgeous mansions herself. There was her longtime Beverly Hills Spanish colonial style mansion where I believe her love of renovation and design began, her massive New York duplex condo, and her current modern oceanfront home in Pacific Palisades. After looking at those places, which one of Tyra's homes was your fave? Personally, I think mine has got to be her original Beverly Hills mansion. I'm also really looking forward to seeing what Tyra has in the works for her latest house flipping project and what she's turned that outdated LA bungalow into. Be sure to let me know which of her homes was your fave down in the comments as well as what other celebrity houses you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram if you haven't already and you want to chat and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!